And listen to that crowd cheering for Patrick Ghost. Roost has not lost a 5k yet this season. He won all three of them in the World Cup, but Giotto did win the 10k. Go to the start. Sportsmanship. I like to see that little fist bump between them before the start. They're rivals, of course. They want to win. But they're also having a very amicable relationship. It looks like Roost is starting off very quickly here. 18.4! And Giotto, 18.9. Yeah, Roost is definitely has a plan. When he skated his track record, he was a tenth of a second faster even in the opener. Twenty-eight five for both. At the World Championships, Giotto was the first to set the time and he started off with a whole bunch of 28 second laps. 28.6, 28.7, those kind of laps. Uh, which he couldn't keep up, but it was a valiant effort. and. He ultimately was still second. So Patrick Roost has the low altitude world record of 604.36. Giotto has his fastest time 611. 28.3 for Giotto. 28.35 is the fastest lap ever skated on this passage. On a low altitude ring. That's super fast. Will he do another low 28 second lap? 28.4. Again, by far the fastest lap ever skated here at sea level. Is this not too much? There is such a thing as going too fast. Let's compare it to the track record. Track record has 2.13. 20. And Giotto is under that with 28.7. Roost not far behind with 29.00. And Giotto again taking the lead. Another 28.7 from Giotto and Roost also goes to the 28. Giotto still ahead of the track record by a few tenths of a second. Track record now had a 28.87 lap. Twenty-eight point nine for Giotto, twenty-nine point three for Roost. Giotto extending his lead. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. I think this will be the first twenty-niner, though. Yeah, 29.2 and Roost 29.4. They're losing a bit on Itrem now, who still had the faster lap time here. So was this not too fast? Difference with Itrem is now less than a second. Back to a second. Which you can see in the bottom right. And Roost has not been beaten yet. 29.3 and 29.1 for Roost. Roost can still win this. As Giotto is known 
for exploding a little bit in the final few laps sometimes. And Patrick Roost has skated a few phenomenally fast final laps. And the difference between them is getting smaller. Roost 28.9, Giotto 29.5. Roost now again under items time and is gaining quick gaining very very quickly and is now for the first time since the 1000 meters ahead of Davide Giotto Roost 28.5 what a lap time what a lap time Absolutely phenomenal. Nearly two seconds ahead of Itrem now. Giotto also still ahead of Itrem. Petre Cruz 28.6. Giotto still 29.8. What a race. What a race is this. Will this be another 6.05? Or 6.06? 6.05.93. 6.08.27. Patrick Roost, European champion. Which is the third fastest time ever skated on low altitude. Only he was faster twice. And Giotto, 608.27, which is almost a personal best, exactly one second above it. But that was skated in Salt Lake City, or Calgary, I'm not sure. Amazing race from Giotto, and also amazing race from Itrem earlier. <laughs> 